Today I am going to tell you about the Windows keyboard shortcuts everyone should know about. Instead of pressing the right click and look for options, let's start with basics. If you want to select all the files, press Ctrl plus A. If you want to copy this black image in the new folder, highlight the file, then press Ctrl C. Open the new folder, press Ctrl V. Duplicate copy of the file is created. If you want to move this black image in the new folder, highlight the file, then press Ctrl X. Open the new folder, press Ctrl V. Now if you want to undo the process, instead of repeating the whole cut and paste process, press Ctrl Z. The black image comes back to the original place. The previous command of cut paste will be undone. If you want to resend the black image in the new folder, press Ctrl Y. The previous command of cut and paste which was undone will get repeated. This redo and undo action works with every command. If you have multiple folders and files on a particular window and want to copy and paste these files in these folders, it will be easier to monitor the whole process if you open multiple numbers of the same window, particularly if the quantity of the file and folders are in large numbers. Instead of pressing right click and selecting open new windows, simply press Ctrl N. Open as many windows you want. If you want to close the current windows or apps, press Alt F4. If you want to switch between these multiple windows, press Alt Tab. Then press left or right arrow to switch between the windows. Everyone knows how to delete a file, but the file goes to the recycle bin. You need to press empty recycle bin in order to permanently delete it from there. Instead, press Shift Delete, the file or folder will get permanently deleted. Suppose you are looking for a keyword in an article. Instead of going through the whole article, press Ctrl G. A small search box will open. Type the word you are looking for and life will become easier. We all know about print screen button. What most people do is go to paint and paste the screenshot then saves it. Instead, press Windows key plus print screen. A screenshot will be taken and get saved in the picture folder as an image file. Or if you want screenshot of small portion of the screen, then press Windows key plus Shift plus S. Sniffing tool menu will appear. Select the portion you want. Then paste it anywhere you want. Lastly, if you want to rename a file, press F2, write whatever you want. That's all for today.